you know, 3 p.m. to the pit. So there's competing terrorist factions involved with this. Some terrorists are trying to pretend my life is theirs to steal money. Other terrorists are trying to accrue wealth and money and finance other terrorist agendas and then also try to steal the money that these other terrorists are stealing. So they have different groups, and some of these terrorists know there's people trying to pretend my life is theirs, so they slander me to them to make money, but that's another source of income for their terrorist financing. So that's a piece of this as well. So there's different terrorists trying to pretend my life is theirs so they can steal large sums of money that's mine and avoid a lawsuit and avoid prison. So then there's other terrorists who know about this, so they slander, to th slander me to them to make money and then uh, I guess make, try to help them with justified in crimes as well as theft and then also sell them my information related to my life so they can have key information related to my life and pretend it's their life because they're trying to get away with theft of money related to my data, IP, and other things. So don't fall for bullshit, but that's a piece of this too, different terrorist factions and then different sources of financing and it's part of it, this financing comes from selling uh, my data and then also like ideas and this and that that they're stealing and then they also sell slander to these guys to make them think they have dirt so they can try to blackmail me and then they're really just making shit up so they can make money because I guess some of these guys are also in a in a fight over money that's mine and they're all fighting over it and stealing it and um, these kids are trying to make the, sell this capitalize off of it by selling this pretended dirt and then make money uh, running slander campaigns and more so that's a piece of it, and it has to do with some Illuminati president jazz. But, um, uh, yeah, these people all need to go to prison. They're all involved with terrorism, organized crime, murder, rape, and more, and uh, so much manufacturing and misrepresenting evidence, multiple life sentence, sentences worth of crimes. Right? And then other people uh, tampering with evidence, destroying evidence, uh, threats and intimidation, large-scale witness tampering. I mean, how are they not all in prison in a federal pen on paper?